hey y'all welcome back to my channel so i hope you all are doing well um so i did some last minute preps i'm gonna go ahead and go through the code items first so i can go ahead and put them away so let's start here with the so delicious pairings uh key lime pie i went ahead and got this again since it's 40 cents after all the um ibotta discounts and i might just add a picture of the discounts um in the video that way you can see and then the chobani flip i went ahead and got my favorite the almond coco loco these are buy one get one free so i went ahead and got two of these and these don't expire until looks like almost christmas christmas eve actually and then i went ahead and got this um starbucks salted caramel mocha just because i wanted to try it and since there was a discount on it i decided to go ahead and give it a shot um this one i'm gonna freeze so i poured some of it out uh just a little bit that way when it freezes if it expands it the bottle won't bust um the next thing i got are these two one pound blocks of cheese the mozzarella I probably will make some lasagna soon or some baked ziti. So I got that so I can shred it up. And then some Monterey Jack cheese. I got this again so I can make those um, white chicken enchiladas with that canned uh, chicken. So I got some of this so I can make that again. And then I got two pie crusts. These are the ready bake pie crusts so I can make a peach cobbler. I got two of these. Um, and if I didn't mention this, all these items were from Walmart. And then the next code item that I picked up is this Berniette Kids. I decided to go ahead and get the strawberry one again. And these are like little smoothies for the kids and these are free through Ibotta. And then my final code item are the Berniette Kids Smart Tubes. And I decided to go ahead and get the strawberry banana one this time. So I'm gonna go ahead and put all the core items up and I'll be back. Okay, let's go ahead and start with the seasoning. So I went ahead and grabbed three of the brown gravy mixes. And then I think this is Aju gravy mixes. These are good with the um, Mississippi roast um, that you put the ranch dressing mix packets and beef packets and it's a really good roast and the pepperoncini peppers. Um, and then I went ahead and get, got some more taco seasonings, taco seasoning mix, some lemon pepper seasoning, Italian seasoning, Morton sea salt, and more complete. So those are the seasonings I went ahead and stocked up on again. And then this is my peach halves and heavy syrup. That way I can uh, do my cobbler. I got two of these. And I went ahead and got some more of the four pack of tuna. I got two of them. Uh, I went ahead and ordered two of the Bristol brand cooked ham. I don't know which brand is better, but I'll probably be opening these up soon um, just to compare the two. I did go ahead and do a Walmart order. I'm not sure if this was dented before they picked it up or when they gave it to me but um we'll have to reconcile that other than that i like being able to do the pickups it keeps me from going to the store and this was a big order it was over 200 dollars. i wouldn't have wanted to do that so these are the honey boy pink salmons i went ahead and got two of these these are not the walmart brand but they're the next cheapest brand that they have in walmart went ahead and got some ghee this is uh, butter that does not have to be refrigerated. I saw this on several people's channel. Honestly thought that the shelf life would be longer than that, but it'll get through the winter. I purchased two navy beans. Um, let's see. I also got some dried beans. These are ham beans brand. They're northern beans with ham flavor. Uh, I was thinking about these ham beans and the cooked ham and put them together to make a meal y'all let me know if y'all have tried that before or have any suggestions on how to cook these i don't have any lentils so i went ahead and got some uh, one pound bag of these lentils two one pound bags and then i 
got the garlic and herb lentils. So this will probably just go in my five pound bucket with my other beans. I went ahead and got some more syrup. This is Best Buy 2022, so these will last a while. I went ahead and grabbed two of those. And they didn't have the regular Ritz, so, which is fine. I got the one with less salt. I plan on probably just eating these with the soups, and the soups have enough salt in them. So, this was a good, good buy. And this is February 2021. I went ahead and got two chicken mansion packs. This is the 12 pack. And I got two of the beef ramen. This was another Ibotta deal. This was in one of my other videos. It's the Ritz cheese crispers. You buy one, you get one free. Um, again, I got the four cheese and herb and the cheddar. I got the Jolly Time Blast of Butter. These, this is great movie theater popcorn. Um, this is as close as you can get to the movie theater. I don't know about y'all, but I really, really miss the movies. But this is good to have for movie nights. I don't have any pork flavored ramen, so I went ahead and uh, ordered 10 of those. And more chocolate. I'll just put this away. It is the um, the 30 piece variety pack, the Reese's, the Hershey's, the Kit Kat, and the Almond Joy. And then I have more pasta. This was also one of the deals, uh, the Skinner brand pasta. I got three of the seashells. I figured I could use these as like a quick lasagna. So if I didn't want to do the whole lasagna dish, I can just use these as the noodles and do a quick lasagna with these. Okay, moving on. I went ahead and got some more spaghetti noodles. As you know, I love some spaghetti, so I have plenty of sauce. I just grabbed some more spaghetti noodles, two of them, and the Skinner brand. And each of these, all five packs, I was able to get 50 cents back, so they ended up being 50 cents each. I got some of our favorite barbecue sauce. This is the Stubbs brand. The Sweet Heat, I haven't tried, but surely it's delicious. The Sticky Sweet, this one's really good. This is one we've had before. And then I went ahead and grabbed two, two more honeys. This is um, Midwest Local Honey. I know if you get your local honey, it's like the best for you, especially after all of this, after the winter, we start getting allergies, so having honey every day really helps with that so went ahead and grab that and some saltine crackers i will probably put these in a uh, the big glass mason jar and secure these so they can last longer because the best by date is march 2021 i have some and i just want to package one up well so it can last a while um the other thing I got were these uh, 12 fruit roll-ups. I saw some games that we could play if we're stuck in the house board. I saw some games that we can use and play these. Um, and the rest of, rest of the items I purchased um, are non-food items, and I'll go over those next. And I would say that for the most part, most of my items I was able to get, but they canceled um, like five of my items. Some spam wasn't available, and then some healthcare items wasn't available either. Okay, so the last few things that I picked up was this Nido milk. Um, the Alaskan granny mentioned this. She said this is better than the one percent. I don't know. I haven't tried it, but went ahead and give it a try, especially since I was getting a dollar fifty back from Ibotta. Um, also picked up some lotion just to get through the winter. To help with dry skin and then some apple cider vinegar this is um this has lots of uses around the house and for health and then some ambasol just in case we can't get to the dentist and someone's having a toothache and then some baby wipes in case we lose water um so that we can clean ourselves 
so anyway guys i hope this was helpful i probably won't be having too many more hauls i'm trying to finish up wrap up um my shopping and complete my six month pantry so if you like this video give it a thumbs up and i'll talk to y'all next time bye